Welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG. Hey Mario, wanna play a game? Sure thing, Jigsaw. What do you got for me? Oh wow, that got a lot harder. Uh, that one? Very good. It's moldy. Thanks a lot, man. Alright. Come on. I think it's that one. Whoa, congratulations, you deserve this. Finally, thank you. A bright card. But I have to get rid of one of these wilted mushrooms. No great loss. It'll let you get into my brother's casino, wherever that is. So we have to find it first. But now we can get in, which is good. Now I'll just throw out these wilted mushrooms, which is what he should have done instead of giving them to me as a supposed prize. Alright, now that that's taken care of, let's continue on. Ah, a note. Take a look at Booster's family portrait, portraits in order from the oldest to the youngest. Well, I have my little note here. Red cap first, then the blonde guy, and the pirate. The punk, triangle man, and Booster himself. Well, that was interesting. Found the Elder Key. Open door. Aw, it looks sad. Let's go cheer it up. Uh, there we go. Okay, maybe not. They gaze into each other's eyes. Mario, she's a bit shy. Look the other way, will you? Um... You can turn around now. She says she's been locked up ever since she took a bite on a booster, so now she wants to help us stir up a little trouble. <laughs> oh, okay, that's fine. And that is the weapon I was talking about in the last video that we could get elsewhere. There, now Bowser's got full equipment. Excellent. But there is still more to be seen, more to be had in Booster's Tower. Let's go all the way. Run, avoid the sniffet. There's a frog coin back here if you jump. And oh, fire floors. Let's avoid the fire. Chomps. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Eat masher. Mwah. Let's show off Bowser's weapon. I didn't time it right, darn. Maybe next time. Alright. In this room? No. Maybe... Ah! Okay. I think it's in the next room. Yep. There's actually a hidden chat in it. There's actually a hidden chest above that one, if you jump on top of it. And we get a goodie bag! It took a minute to display the text. I already knew what it was going to say, though. And since we're all the way up here anyway, why not take a look out here? I wonder when my next bride will fall from the sky. And Mario's just going to back away from that one. Uh, poor lonely guy. Well, that's all. Now we can climb down. That goodie bag can be used an infinite number of times without ever disappearing. But it can only be used in battle. It'll give you... oops. It'll give you one coin. Which, since I'm in a battle, I might as well show it off. It'll give you one coin every time you use it, so... You have a very tedious source of infinite coins. Joy. Let's try and get the timing this time. Yeah. You get the timing and the chomp chomps into the enemy. Alright. Now let's get out of here without triggering any more fires, hopefully. There we go. 
Down we go! So yeah, you can get infinite... You can get as many coins as you want out of that goodie bag, but... It will take a while. It's really not worth it to do. However, the goodie bag is still worth getting. Because you can sell it for 555 coins. So yeah. That's definitely worth grabbing. If you know it's there. Now let's go back and revisit Booster Pass. There's a little switch down here you can trigger to trap the spinies forever. And to get you coins. I don't even know if you actually get those coins or what. I never really paid attention to that. But you don't have to deal with the spinies anymore if you go through there again, I guess. Now... Here's what appeared when a miss hit that switch in Booster Tower. And if we jump along, we'll encounter... Apprentice. Golly, you're that famous Mario guy! If I beat you, don't make me sniff it for, if I'm lucky. Yeah, if you're lucky. Which you're not. Sorry. Wah! Now they'll make me take the training course over again! See ya. Now we get to the end of here, and we get a frog coin, and a flower, and a Kiro Kiro Cola. Ah, very nice. I was wrong about what's up here. Nice flower, and frog coin, and awesome healing item. Alright. And we take a painful shortcut to the bottom. Now, I don't really have to come here, but eh, why not? Let's see, uh, there's a couple items. There'll be a third item that this guy will sell later, but for now, he's got two. I found some neat stuff, and I'm open up, opening up a miner's store. Come and take a look at what I've got to sell. A lucky jewel. It's sure to bring you plenty of good luck. You can use it as many times as you want. If you use it, it'll have the same effect as a lucky flower. You'll be able to bet your experience or your coins at the end of the battle. But I don't want that. Oh, he doesn't have the other item yet. Guess I'm getting ahead, getting a little ahead of myself. The next item I'll have is like a mystery egg or something like that, which will uh you have to use it ten times with Peach with the B tub ring equipped, and it'll turn into a lamb's lure. And you have to use the lamb's lure like 42 or 48 times or something like that with anyone to turn it into the sheep attack, which can put enemies to sleep. Uh, I don't think I'm going to bother with that. <laughs> well, he will sell fireworks to me for, like, I've only got the sparklers down, but I ain't giving up. Want to buy one for 500 coins? Yeah, I'll go ahead and do it now while we've got some money. Thanks! Yeah, just wait for my masterpiece. Come back with more coins and buy my inventions, all right? Sure thing, buddy. It's expensive, but I want to do it. I'll talk to her later. For now, let's, uh, revisit the mines. There's something at the end here that I don't really have to show you, but I figure why not while we're going back through everything. There's the moles. Mario, I owe you one for saving my kids. What's that? You want to hear the Moleville blues? Well, all right. Digging deep in the mines. See, note the, uh, the me there. You wanna jot those down. The do, do, me. Don't get much sun, I'm covered with soil till my work day is done. I really hate sitting, it's labor I choose, cause then the time to do them old Moville blues. Alright, let's get out of here. So yeah, you write those down cause you need those for... Todofsky, or whatever, at Tadpole Pond. Which we'll go to in a little while. Probably not in this video, because... Look at that. I've already used up about nine and a half minutes. <sighs> Alright. Back to Pipe Vault, because there's stuff in here. Let's go. Avoid the fire. 
Avoid the lava. <laughs> All right. Don't get squished. Oh. Oh well. It'll be easy enough to win, so no big deal. Hmm. Gotta get the timing down on that one. I'll admit, I don't use Bowser much when I play normally. He's strong, though. He's not as high-leveled as Mario or Mallow, and he's doing pretty decent damage anyway. Well, he's only a couple levels lower, I think, but still. Now this frog coin, I gotta admit, I never knew how to get this thing either. I looked it up, and it's stupid. I don't know why you'd think to do this when nothing else in the game works this way. You gotta run, press down, it's kind of hard to do. You gotta press down just as you reach the end of there, and you'll, like, slide under. I'm not good at doing it at all. There we go. I don't know why you would think to do that. Wait, wait, wait. I wanna go down that one. There's a couple worthwhile items to get out of this minigame. Step right up. Do some Goomba thumping. Sure, why not? You know the rules? Sure do. It's easier if you stand in the middle. Okay, here's as many as you can. Ready? Go! Don't get more than 20. Just trust me on this. I'll explain in a bit. Goomba thumping. I missed the golden Goomba. I am sad. I missed another one. I'm gonna wait this time. I failed. I need gold. Yeah, there we go. Yes. Excellent. X. Oh, I missed it. This is gonna be a close one. 20. Alright. No more. Just gonna let the timer run down. 20 points. That was some thumping. Here's a prize. Next time, try and get 22 points. Now see, if we had gotten, say, 25 points, he'd be asking us to get 27 points next time. He just adds two onto whatever you got. So, only meet your quota. Do not exceed it, if you know what's good for you. Flower tab. Uh, lots of items. I'll get rid of one of the mid-mushrooms. Just use up the flower tab right now. Excellent. More flower points. Now let's go ahead and do it again. This time to get 22 points. Because we can get a flower jar. Yes, more golden goombas. Oh, missed him. Haha. Well, okay, I'll make it. There we go. I'll take my flower jar now, please. All right. That was some thumping. Here's your prize. Next time, 24. All right. Cool, man. Flower jar. Excellent. I might come back here and do some more of that off-screen. After the flower jar, he'll keep giving you frog coins. He'll give you one frog coin every time you can meet the score you need to. But I don't want to do any more of that on screen. May do it off screen though, so D2 will have some more frog coins. Maybe he can get the screw dream. Alright, Yoster Isle. Let's go ahead and save. Alright. And we'll pick it up here next time. See ya.